Many students of public schools believe that school uniforms should not be introduced because it is restraining people's freedom of expression and does not create diversity. However, there are many positives to having school uniforms. Many people who have gone through educational practices that require uniforms have stated that uniforms are positive for them and were enjoyable. Although a uniform can get boring with the same clothes and same color every day, uniforms have proven to lower hostility in many schools. There is no bullying or biases towards other schoolmates because there is a unifying factor. It is important to acknowledge that public schools tend to have a more widespread student population and there are children of different backgrounds. Some have parents with rather high incomes who can afford to buy fashionable and costly clothes for their kids, but there are those teens who are forced to buy low-cut outfits at discount retail stores. So, from this viewpoint, if all students wear identical clothes, no one will be hurt or humiliated by the comparisons. Another positive that students have listed is the easiness of having a set uniform to wear every day. There is no time spent figuring out outfits or accessories the night before school, and there is a sense of comfort knowing you will look presentable and fit into school the next day. In addition to uniforms lowering irrelevant worries, they, have, they also help students focus on learning. Students' clothing distracts learning because teenagers especially care way too much on how others see them. When uniforms are enforced, students are not to be distracted on how they look all the time, which gives them more time to focus on their studies. Without distracting clothes, students start to care about the school more and are definitely more positive thinkers because they do not need to worry about how they look as long as they feel good about themselves. Overall, you can now understand how uniforms help students focus on learning. While children believe that school is trying to control their freedom of speech by enforcing uniforms, a school is not a fashion show. It is there to educate children and help them get into college and a worthwhile future career. Besides, some private schools even have dress down days where the students are allowed to express themselves by wearing their own clothes to school. Also, wearing uniforms may be less expensive than having to dress a child in different clothes each day. With the uniform comes a few of the same materials, but it is unnecessary to have an abundance of these clothes. Children want the most fashionable items, and the fashion industry puts out a lot of influential style tips. So, for a parent, this could be very costly. Uniforms correct this idea. If public schools were to decide to make uniforms mandatory, it would be a lot easier on parents, and the school would not have to worry about children dressing inappropriate. While most private schools already have established a particular school uniform to be worn within the institution at all times by all students, public schools mostly remain more liberal and only have a more or less strict dress code. Also, it is beneficial for young students to get used to corporate dress because in the work field, appropriate dress is required and in some cases wear the same attire, such as nurses and companies. Uniforms introduce to students how to dress for a corporate occasion and prepares them for the adult wor world. Wearing the same clothes as your classmates and schoolmates helps to make teenagers feel better, more involved into the community, and integrate with the groups of children of the same age. It helps them feel that they belong rather than do not fit in. Another benefit of school uniforms is that it teaches children certain discipline and conformity. The qualities they will later in life make a lot of use from when they have to obey certain social norms and laws. I hope you now understand the importance of uniforms and the unity it brings.